Hey guys, it's Jordan from Big Brothers Big Sisters and today we are going to make a rice sock bunny. This is what it looks like. Everything you need is one sock, it can be any color you'd like, any size, a cup, some rice, some elastic bands, and if you don't have elastic bands, you can also use a string, a hair tie, whatever you like to like kind of tie it, and some ribbon if you would like. And then a Sharpie, marker, pen, whatever you would like to or have to draw on the sock. So the first step you do is you take your sock and you put it like kind of inside your cup and put the top of it around the top. This helps you so you can put the rice in there without like spilling it all over. The second step is to pour some rice into the sock. So you just want to pour some in, not too, too much, it's just to make your bottom. So then once you have your rice in there, you're ready to take the sock off of the cup. So once you take it off, you put it in the cup and you want to like kind of pull it down and make it nice and tight. And then you want to take your elastic, any elastic, any size, I just have these small ones. So then you kind of push it down and you tie it around. Just like that. So once you have a bottom like this, you want to make your little tail. So you can pick any place at the bottom. I'm just going to do it right back here. And you want to grab like a little bulge here and kind of just pull it out. I twist mine to kind of just get a good little bulge, bulge going. And then I take my elastic and I just tie it around. And there you have your little tail. Ooh. Just like that. So after you have your tail, I just put my sock back into the cup as good as you can. And I just put it back around so I can put some more rice in there. So then you go ahead and you put some more rice, just like that, like we did the first one, and then you're ready to take it off of the cup again. So once you take it off, you have this, and you just want to repeat the same step where you kind of pull it down and you put another elastic around it. Just like that. So then you have this. So now the next step is to making the ears. And I forgot to mention you do need scissors too. So you just want to cut down the middle at the top here. Sometimes it's easier to even lay it down like this. You just want to cut down in the middle. So once you cut down the middle, you have two ears just like this. So now it's time to grab your ribbon. If you want to, you don't have to add your ribbon. And you just wrap it around the center here. And I just cut it off. And then you just tie in a little bow or a little knot, whatever you'd like. Just like this. So once you tie your ribbon on, you're basically all ready to go and now you can draw your face on the front of your bunny. You can do any face you like, you can make it silly. I'm just gonna draw two little eyes and a little mouth. Well, like no slash mouth, I just did a little X. And there you go. Now you have your sock bunny. 